many other counties, but Maricopa County is, is picking up. Statewide unemployment has changed. A year ago it was 8.4% and is now 7.8%. We added 51,800 non-farm jobs in the state. Private sector added 51,100 jobs, which is the largest gain since 2007. And 2007 is when the economy tanked. So things are things are picking up. Uh, Rasmussen latest poll showed 65% think that government should cut spending, and that would help the economy. Duh. Duh. <laughs> Duh. Um, we passed a bill. We passed several that that I'll be going over. But all of you are pretty much aware of the federal uh, travel plans that are, that's happening, that <laughs> BLM and Forest Service is cl closing down roads and such. Mm -hmm. uh, but when they do that, they still ex expect that our sheriffs are to enforce the federal regulations. So if you're uh, on the Forest Service property and you're not supposed to be, they expect our, your local sheriff to enforce uh, the federal laws. Well, we passed a bill that said they don't have to. It's up to them if there's a fire, you know, they can they can opt to go in and, and, and do that. But uh, the only ones that were opposed to that, of course, was the environmentalists because they don't want you on any of the federal property. <coughs> Which all is our the, property. Yeah, all the, all the uh, county sheriffs were in support of this because they're they're getting harassed because they're not enforcing federal laws. Now, border issues, when the state enforces federal laws along the border, they don't want us to do that. But on travel management, it's a different story. They expect us to do. So we, we did pass a good good bill uh, to prohibit that. Hey, I'm sorry, have you heard from Sheriff Daniels on that? Is he He's in support of it, yes. Yeah. So he will not enforce that? He, we gave him the option. You know, it depends on what it is. If there's somebody that's lost, uh, that needs help, search and rescue. If there's a fire. Hikers. Hikers, uh, yeah. And what, what they can do if you're on uh, federal property, it's, it's not supposed to be on, they'll probably say, hey, you know, federal law says you're not supposed to be here. Uh, they might remind you. Do, and do the feds have their own agents? A, a handful that can still bust you, though? They can't. Yeah, the fed. The fed. And, and that's, the, the feds want to dump as much responsibility on the local government. Uh, but if they want their laws enforced, they're going to have to do it themselves. And I don't need to interrupt you, and I'll, and I'll, I'll shut okay. up. Is it or is it not okay to carry a firearm on that land anymore? On I know federal I, property, you're not supposed to. I remember when you passed, saying you could. Within weeks, they, the feds came back and said, oh, no, you can't. In fact, in fact, we had... Uh, we had an issue with, uh, uh, they, they tried to get people to come climb over the fence and be on it and then they'd arrest them. Mm -hmm. And uh, half the people stayed on one side, the other half went on the, the federal property. They arrested all the people on the federal property and they enticed them. They said, come on over here. Mm -hmm. They wanted them over so that they could arrest them. And trap them. Question. Yes. Uh, I'm 15. Oh, I'm sorry. That 50,000 jobs, that was for the year? Yes. How come the state and the federal government, you never, they always tell you how many jobs were made, but you never tell you how many people entered the workforce during that time? Well, the, the, we, yeah, we can do our figures statewide. The, yeah. feds, the federal government yeah, but I'm plays like, games. What I'm saying is we made 50,000 jobs, but if we had 100,000 people into the workforce, with 50,000 worse off than we were. Not only that, but you know, take a look at the people that good, stop looking. You know, yeah, how many have stopped looking? Good, but how many are part time instead of full time? Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, but the unemployment is is increasing. It is sure. it's doing better in Maricopa County. There's yeah. there's quite a few businesses going into Maricopa. Yeah. Right. Uh, with sequestration, Fort Huachuca, and the different rural areas, uh, you know, we're still hurting. The real estate market in Maricopa County is, is I really good. Wouldn't put too much faith in that base. Um, I have a question with the, when the federal lands were first set up, isn't there anything in the law that protects it for us to be able to use it? <coughs> well, and that's what Utah has done, and there's been five other states that have passed similar laws, and, 
and we hope to reintroduce that next year. We okay. did have a bill, and the governor vetoed it last year. Oh. Because that's the one I was hoping. So would we're go. hoping that it'll go back on the ballot. Okay. And, and so, over the over the interim, we have a private property study group a committee that's formed. Mm -hmm. And so we have required every county to identify how much property, you've seen my red and white map, Yes. Mm -hmm. how much property is in private hands, how much of that private property is tax exempt, and how much is in conservation. Mm 